guys, it's Coffee, and we're back playing the 100 Bibi Challenge. I'm pretty stoked about this. And um, yeah, we're just gonna play. I'm not really sure what happened, but it seems like all of like everyone's needs, nobody needs to sleep, even though it's like 8 p.m. Um, our biggest concern, obviously, is Emily. And I did review a lot of your guys' comments in the last episode. And Everybody was like, make her an artistic prodigy because apparently that is like the skill that is going to benefit us the most. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to have Juliet come down here and clean up. And then we're going to have Marcos go ahead and serve taco casserole for dinner for all of the kids. And hold on, let me just see what everyone's doing. Okay, let me go ahead and actually take a look at everybody's grades. You're a C student. You need to get your skills up, but you're really hungry right now. Um, I am going to go ahead and have her clean this up and then come and do a painting. I'm going to take a little coffee sip. Guys, coffee si sips are back in full swing. Hmm. Ooh, I just made that and it is very hot. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to go ahead and have her draw shapes. I'm pretty sure that's how that works because I can't interact with the easel. So I'm pretty sure that's how she gets her art skill up, right? Okay, let me go ahead and look at everybody else. You need to get more skills up. What do you have skill? And you have skill in social. So go ahead and practice your speech. You are a superstar, but you need to do your homework. So let's go ahead. I'm actually going to wake him up and have him do his homework. Wait, have these other kids done their homework? No, you've done your homework. And you've done your homework. But you need to do yours. And your skills are up. Okay, cool. So him and his sister, um, Alice and Levi, might actually get to age up once they get their homework done. I am having... Yeah, okay, so apparently if you get it... Oh, I can have her play the violin, too. Nice. Okay, good. This is done. So we're going to go ahead and call to meal. Call everybody to the meal. There we go. All right, I'm going to have her go ahead and stop and actually come get some food because she's very hungry and she is like the star of the show now. So we're going to go ahead and light this to Soothing Sage. Um, hopefully, hold on, I'm going to have this one stop. I'm going to have them all come and eat really quick and then I'll go back and have them do their homework because that seems reasonable to me. Oh, I can't practice. Wait, oh. Okay, we'll have you practice your speech. And then we'll have her go back up when she's finished and draw. Because apparently that's how we do. Oh, and I'm going to go ahead and also purchase a violin for her. Because I just think that that makes sense. So we're going to go ahead and skills okay we're gonna go ahead and actually grab a violin um i'll just put this over here for right now sounds good and then i'll go downstairs okay what does this say tension relieving relieving relief scent okay I love that he cleaned up hers. That was so sweet. Okay, so everybody's eating. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm going to have him go ahead and put that away. And once we get down to just Emily in the house, I'm actually going to move probably the entire family to a new house. Um, and it will be the house that... Emily will end up taking over. So we'll sell this house and we'll get a new house and Juliet and Marcos will come with Emily because I want them to live out their days until they die because it just like seems so weird to not keep them in the series. Like I can't just like leave. It just, it feels wrong, you know? Okay. So hopefully everyone's doing what I said. And it looks like it. So awesome, 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 awesome. I'm going to go back up here with Emily. 
because like previously stated, she is my main point of concern. So I'm just going to watch after her. Okay, that was weird. Homework complete. Okay, let me click on Alice really quick and see. She's going to do the extra credits. And he's currently doing his, but once he finishes... Oh, I can also have this child stop because I think she only needed to get a scale to level two. And Emily, I'm going to have... Clean that up. And I'm actually going to have her... Wait, can she not play it? What? Hold on. What? Is that the only way? The Sims rooms. Okay. Draw two pictures while inspired. She's not currently inspired, which is bum, bummy, bummy. I don't know why I just, that's a new word. Um, how can I make you inspired? I wonder if this will inspire her. What's this? Oh, she's getting tired. Well, it is one o'clock in the morning. I probably should have her go to sleep. She's not currently inspired, so I am going to have her finish this. And, okay. Are you... Oh, okay. You know what? I'm actually going to have her... No, no, no. Pause, 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 pause. I'm going to have her go to the restroom first because... Oh, that was weird. Yeah, go ahead and use that and then go to sleep. Go. Go, lovey. Go. She's getting there. Okay. Apparently she can't play the violin, which in my opinion is totally garbage. Ah, oh, why did you wake up? It's all your fault, Marcos. Go. And then I'll have him go back to sleep. Oh, and now these kids are up. Dang it. What's this? Scared of monster. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hold the phone. I got to get that freaking light that keeps monsters away, I guess. And I've seen it. I know what it looks like. I think it's this one. I'm pretty... Is it this one? Or no, it's the defender. Okay, it's this one. I'm going to go ahead and... Where can I... Okay, I'm going to put that right there and right there. I'm going to put these in like every kid's room because I am sick and tired of this. Put you in here and put you in here. And then I'm going to make sure that all of them are turned on like all the time. So, okay, they are on currently. And I'm pretty sure they stay on. So, yay, yay. Okay, you're using that. Don't deal with the loud noises. And then I want you to go ahead. Too scared to sleep in bed right now. Well, that's great. Go ahead and take a shower. Ah, uh, she still won't go to sleep. She's scared for the next 18. What what are you what? Okay, apparently everybody had to pee, so there's that. Um, can I have you go take a bowl bath? That should help you. Go take a bowl bath, love, and then I'll put you back to bed. Wonder if Alice can go to sleep now. Yeah, it looks like she can. So I'll have them go back to sleep until school starts. And Juliet, what are you doing? What's this? New baby, even though we don't have any babies at this point. Um, Juliet probably should still be writing. So I'm going to go ahead and have her write her biography because she is getting pretty old, you know? Okay. Everybody probably needs to start waking up for school. Oh, sure. Okay, there's that. Oh, we'll have Marcos. Uh, we'll just replace it, actually. Never mind. Um, does Marcos... Oh, you guys told me that Marcos can actually retire, which is freaking great. So we're actually going to do that. We're going to have him retire. Are you sure Marcos will retire? Should he do so? A daily payment will be made each day based on his current hourly pay. So... He is actually going to retire because he can. Okay. All the kids are going to school. Um, we're going to have each of them 
study hard and they're probably all gonna come home pissed off but it is what it is okay and julia is up here writing her book more books so we're gonna go ahead and fast forward this i'm gonna have some more coffee mm. ah, yum and as soon as Emily has an A, I'm, I don't think I'm going to age her up. We're actually going to like stay with her and try to get, I'm at least going to try to get her aspiration done as a child and then I'll age her up. That's going to be like our goal with Emily is to hit that aspiration. Because if you, um, if you get the aspiration, you actually get to keep those skills. So it's really cool. And currently I'm just going to work. Juliet to the freaking bone. Um, basically, so we can make as much money as humanly possible before she passes away. Because whatever she makes is what's going to pass down to Emily. And Emily won't be able to make money right away because she can't even work on her art skill yet because I can't, like, she can work on this, but, like, she can't work on easels, which I think I'm going to have her be a painter. Like, that's how she's going to make money is being a painter. Mm. <sighs> that coffee is really good okay so he's retired what can we have you work on if you're retired lovey um i don't even know i don't know what he even likes to do what are your hobbies he's neat he's an art lover he's romantic and domestic from choosing a family aspiration. That's cool. I don't even think I knew that you could have that. So he's an art lover. Let's go ahead and actually have him paint. Um, we'll have him scrap this painting and come upstairs and paint because, you know, he's old. Maybe, maybe that's what he wants to do. Yes, make a flirty painting. Acquire the painting skill. Marcos' new skill is painting while I'm the great beautiful. That's really cool. You go, Glen Coco. You go, Marcos. I almost called him Marcus. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, okay. Julia actually finished that book, so we're going to have her come down here and we're going to have her sell this to a publisher. <laughs> so she's going to come down here and do this. Also, um, I, I am going to mention that. I should have mentioned it in the beginning of the episode. But a lot of people are really upset in the comment section about... And I, I generally don't address things because I try to stay away from the negativity and just delete comments as I don't like them. But this one has just been persistent and... Uh, um, a lot of people were upset that Juliet doesn't have wrinkles or look old. And it's because I have a skin pack on her. I have a custom skin pack on her and I like it that way. Like she's a glamour. She's a glamorous grandma. And I feel like that's how Juliet would want to be. And so that's why I left her that way and didn't change it. And I also have gotten a lot of comments that I should just delete all of my CC. And I'm sorry, but I think that CC happens to really enhance the game. And I like the way that it makes the game look. So I'm not going to be doing that either. Um, so I just hope you guys can understand those of you that did comment that. And everybody else who was super supportive, thank you so much. You guys rock. And that's all I'm going to say about that. Okay, what? What? Oh, it's like Lady in the Tramp. I get it. It's spaghetti with like cats. How freaking cute is that? That's adorable. That is super adorable. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and have him sell this to a collector. Make us a little more money because why not? Um, and then I'll have Juliet come up here and she needs to keep writing. I'm going to have her write, let's have her write a motivational book because she's feeling really confident right now. And we'll have you do a large, oh, we'll have you do a large classic painting. All right. So that's what they're going to do. Um, Juliet and them. Okay. Are the kids, the kids are going to be home very soon. Thank goodness. I'm looking forward to it. I think they get home at 3 or 3.30. Okay. Grades are up. Melody has a B. <gasps> Alice has an A. Emily has a B. And Levi has a B. So we can actually go ahead and age Alice up, which I think Alice is the 
oldest. So that Alice or no, was it Alice or Melody that was the oldest? I think it was Alice that was born first. So we're going to go ahead and not bother with the homework. We're going to stop Juliet from doing this and we're going to have her clean out spoiled food. And then we're going to have her cook a gourmet meal. And we're going to actually do some kind of cake. Do you guys know if you can put candles on a cheesecake? Like I'm going to make a cheesecake and see what happens. I've always wanted to do it and I never do. Okay. And then we're going to have these kiddos. Um, let's have Marcos actually stop and have him come down here and cook some buttered popcorn. And I'm going to have all the kids watch a movie and have some popcorn. Hey, Juliet. Oh, okay. Grab a serving, grab a serving, grab a serving, grab a serving. Oh, she's taking a nap, but I'm going to wake her up. Grab a serving. And then I'm going to have all of them watch this kid's movie, except Juliet. So hopefully they'll all be in a better mood. Okay, hopefully that will cheer everyone up and then we can work with them again. And Juliet's going to keep working on this cheesecake. I'll finish him like a cheesecake. You guys know what I'm talking about from Pitch Perfect? <laughs> mm. I love that movie, Pitch Perfect. I've seen it so many times. Okay. I need to know if we can... Oh, we can add birthday candles to the cheesecake. Yes. Okay, so this is for Alice. Um, Alice, come here and add your birthday candles, boo-boo. I'm actually going to have Alice come over here and do that. Come on, Alice. Oh, it does this to me every time. Okay, add birthday candles. And I'm going to have you make a wish. All right. All right. So Alice is going to be a freelance botanist. And we're going to make her an outdoors lover. Because that sounds nice. Oh, she's cute. I almost don't even think I need to mess with her. Because usually as teens, I give them makeovers. And I just... I don't think I'm actually going to bother because A, she looks cute, and B, um, I'm really more concentrated on Emily right now. So um, go ahead and grab a serving of cheesecake, you crazy girl. Okay, let me go ahead and pause really quick and see what everyone needs. What do all y'alls need? What do, okay, you are just hungry. So I'm gonna have you come and grab a serving as well. And then I'm going to have you do your homework. And you need some social interaction, but you're not like dying without it. So I'm going to have you just go ahead and start working on your homework. You are insanely tired. So she is going to, I'm going to let her nap. That's fine. You can nap. Nap. Um, you need a shower. And to empty your bladder. So go ahead and have you use this. Take a shower. Um, and then I'm going to have her get to work on her homework as well. And she also needs to get one skill to level three, which she's already done. So she should be a lot easier, which is great. Um, Emily really needs to go use the restroom. And have her do that. Hopefully her sister doesn't come up right behind her. Okay, go ahead and take another nap. Ugh, Emily, you're the worst. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to have Emily go to sleep instead of nap because it's already 830 and I'll just have her when she wakes up. I will have her do her homework. 
and everybody else can just work on theirs currently. Okay, let me actually see this. Do the extra credits. Oh, and actually, you guys, that is the timer for this episode. So I will meet you guys back in the next episode. Thank you so very much for watching. Please don't forget to follow me over on Instagram and Twitter. I am at CoffeeYT, and this is Coffee signing off. Hey you guys, it's Chloe and today I am going to be sharing my current reads and the things that I'm excited to read. Kind of like a book haul. You guys know how these go. Uh, I've done a few of them on my channel and a lot of you guys react really positive to them and you tell me that you really are always curious to see what I'm reading. I apologize now if you can hear any jangling. My cats are crazy hyper right now. I just fed them so hopefully they will chill out. Um, and also second point that I don't even need